they go after him talking about enemies within because, you know, he's a little upset with the likes of Letitia James, Alvin Bragg, Jack Smith, and Fannie Willis, <laughs> right? They go on about him complaining about how there's these enemies out there, like trying to literally destroy him, when I, I think it's, it's kind of obvious that that's kind of what had been going down. Well, he's somehow wrong for, for complaining about this. He's called me venomous. We will fight back to your attempt to bring Trumpism to New York City. He's called me disgraceful. A that they stole the Supreme Court seat. An illegitimate president and an illegitimate member of the United States Supreme Court. He's called me radical. Listen. Yes. We know he's crazy. Yes. We know he doesn't have a sound mind. Yes. We know he's out of control. We know he's losing it. We know his days are numbered and we will come together. He's called me a racist. We've got to stand up to an, an administration which is too male, too pale, and too stale. Okay, so who's the one that's divisive here, really and truly? And why is he getting tarred and feathers, so to speak, for daring to say that there are people, like that lady you just saw who's about to get her case thrown out of court with the New York Court of Appeals, like that lady, why can he not actually say that she is a political enemy? You talk about the enemy within. There's enemies, America's enemies yeah. outside. Uh, the enemy within is a pretty ominous phrase if you're talking about other Americans. I think it's accurate. I mean, I think it's accurate. Who are you talking about? Uh, and, the enemy? you know, I heard that. They said, oh, the enemy. On the outside, you have Russia, you have China, you have a lot of different groups. If you have a smart president, they can be easily handled. I handled them. We had no wars. I had no, we had no wars. The only thing I had was ISIS, and I defeated them in, like, record time. They were gone. But I started no wars. The outside people, the so-called enemies, if they're enemies, and they might not be enemies, mm -hmm. if you have a smart president, they can be handled. But when you have people investigating my campaign, when you have people, you know, they spied on my campaign now. You understand that. That's <laughs> been proven. But they spy on your campaign. The Russia, Russia, Russia hoax was, was all made up, and now it's acknowledged that it was made up. All of these different things. You have the 51 different agents saying it was from Russia, and now they all say it wasn't from Russia. Okay, mm -hmm. so we were lying. All, uh, many other things, many, many. I could go, you just don't have enough time. But what they've done is so terrible. Who's ever heard of anything like this? Adam Shifty Schiff, he's a crooked guy. He's a crooked politician, 100%. And he's going to be a senator now. Can you believe it? Uh, but again, no, he's no, a political opponent of yours, he's not, he's an no, enemy. No, he's a... Well, he is, of course, he's an enemy. He's an enemy. He wanted to put my son in jail, and my son didn't even know what he was talking so, about. So Trump is making the point that, you know what, they're going after him with everything they got. They want to put him in jail, by the way, too. I mean, you heard from Letitia James. It's quite evident what she wants to do with him. So how is this woman, Letitia, or how is, for example... Shifty Shift, Adam Shift, how are they not enemies of him? I mean, you listen to this and you tell me, is this woman not an enemy? I've taken on powerful interests like developers. I've taken on legislators. I've taken on landlords. I've taken on powerful interests in the city of New York because I believe in a good fight. And right now, what we need is someone who understands that you should not be afraid, not be fearful of Donald Trump. We should take him down. We should sue him all the way to bankruptcy. We should investigate his business interests. We should investigate his business holdings. We should investigate whether or not why he was in a why he was once in debt and now in a position to purchase all of this property. We can do that because I've been trained to do that and I will do that at the same time knowing the office of attorney general and its powers and its responsibilities. Okay, so, so again, how is she not a political enemy of sorts? They want to take him down, okay? And now they're accusing him of doing exactly what they've wanted to do to 
to him all along. And then the, the crazy thing is when he's pushed on this and he's like, okay, so are you going to try and lock them up? His answer is, and he's told me this personally, by the way, guys, as it relates to Hillary Clinton, his answer is no. I think they're unethical, but who knows? I want to drill down on this question of retribution because against your political opponents, because yeah. you've um, had opportunities to walk that back. And my question is this, are you prepared to say now that you will not use law enforcement to punish or prosecute your political opponents? Excuse me, that's what they're using on me. Okay, so your well, experience is well, that they started you, Before you start this. Yeah, I got Howie, it. that's what they're using on me. I've got DAs, I've got uh, everybody. They look at me, I, there's never been anything like this. The biggest case was the one down in Florida and I beat it 100%, I won the case. Because we had, a, a, a number one, a brilliant judge and a judge that moved rather rapidly and I won the case. By the way, Biden had almost the same case but he didn't have the presidential records yet record, because yeah. he wasn't the president, just to finish. And he got off on the basis that he's incompetent a sec, you know, essentially Bizarre. that he's incompetent. And it was a strange ruling because they said, number one, he's incompetent, so he's not going to be good. But he was, the prosecutor actually said he's guilty. Okay. But he's so you've heard that sound before. If, if you watch this show regularly, I, I've been playing it a lot because it's just mind boggling how they can try and twist and invert everything. 